in this question we have two events event a is uh, the selected person actually has hiv and event b is uh, test shows hiv positive okay these are the two events so now what is given the first statement tells of the people having hiv 90% of the test detect the disease this means that probability of uh, b given a is equal to uh, 90% which is equal to 0.9 okay and what is the second statement telling us of the people people free of hiv uh, 99% of the test are just hiv negative but 1% are diagnosed as showing hiv positive that means probability of the test showing hiv positive given that people are free from hiv that means a complement it is equal to 1% it is not 99% it is 1% it is equal to 0 0.01 okay and what is the next statement telling from a large population of which uh, only 0.1% have hiv this means that this is the actual value therefore probability of selecting a person actually having hiv is probability of a which is equal to 0.1% which is 0 0.001 okay one person is selected at random so probability of selecting the person having hiv is 0 0.001 okay and he is given the hiv test and the pathologist reports him or her as hiv positive so now it is known to us that uh, the test report is hiv positive therefore b is given to us and what you have to find what is the probability that the person actually has hiv that means probability of a given that b is true this is what you have to find this we can find using the bayes theorem uh, bayes theorem tells that uh, this is equal to probability of b given a into probability of a divided by probability of b given a into probability of a plus probability of b given a complement into probability of a complement okay now we know what is probability of b given a it is 0.9 what is probability of a 0 0.001 what is probability of b given a it is again 0.9 probability of a is 0 0.001 probability of b given a complement is 0 0.01 and what is probability of a complement? Uh, we know probability of a complement is equal to one minus probability of a. Correct? This is equal to one minus point zero zero one, which will be point nine nine nine. So now now I have all the values. So if I substitute them, I'll get uh, point nine into point zero zero one divided by 0.9 into 0 0.001 plus uh, 0 0.01 into uh, 0.999. Correct? What will this be? Uh, if I take 0 0.01 common, uh, 0 0.001 I'll take common. Then this will be one. This I can replace by one, and this I have to replace by ten. Okay. This is equal to 0 0.9 by 0 0.9 plus 9.99, which is equal to uh, 0 0.9 by 10.89, which can also be written as 90 by 1089. This is our final answer.